Hello everyone, today I'm going to be reviewing CTC MAC 12 month family membership. Hello everyone, Michelle Debray from Schooling Mama. Welcome to my channel and if you're new here, make sure you subscribe and hit notification bell so you don't miss any of my homeschooling videos. So today I am reviewing CTC Math. So make sure when you're done watching the video that you check the description box for everyone's review and also link where you can get a more in-depth look of CTC Math. So CTC Math, it is an online program, math program, for kids in K all the way to calculus. So you can use it for you know your kids, your little ones that are just you know starting school, and all the way if you have a child, an advanced kid that's doing you know, calculus or needs some extra practice. One of the things that this program is geared for is to give your kids that extra practice, the kids that need to catch up on their math or are really struggling. This program will give them that boost of confidence to be able to keep you know moving on with their with with their math you know education one of the good things that i like about this program is when you purchase it you can you know purchase it you know depending on the number of kids you have but for each kid it's not just one specific grade so you can purchase it for your third grader but you have access to the k2 uh lessons but also for the you know for the high schooler or you know all the other grades so i think it's, it is that is such a wonderful thing because in, in case your child moves on you know, from you know third grade math, so they can you know keep going. So when you get it, you have access to all the grade levels. So all these lessons are short uh, tutorials between four to nine minute you know tutorials that your child is gonna watch after they watch the video, and they can either do the math problems online or you can print out something you know you know for for them to do a worksheet. Some kids like to work better with you know paper and pencil. Some kids like to do the you know the problems online. So you have the choice to do that. And there's also where you can print out the lesson. So in case they need some extra practice or you need to explain things to them, you know, again, they don't have to watch the video and you can go over, you know, the lesson with them. This program has placement tests, but one of the things that I noticed and I saw that the, the, the placement tests are, it is, it is very time consuming. And because it's not just a quick test that they take and it, you know, and it, in it, you know, places them in a specific level. So you, you take, you know, based on where you think they are, you take some, you know, a placement test, a lot of them, and then it will give you more, in like, it's, it's more, it's, it's very in depth, but it, it is very time consuming. So I will, you know, it, it depends on how you want to do it. You can just pick where you think your child is and either go lower a little bit, you know, and, and, and see how they um, keep progressing through the program. But the placement test is there for you, but you don't have to use it if you don't want to. Uh, I guess it's very time consuming. So you can just pick where you think your child is and go from there. So you can be, because since you have the luxury of going back and forth and, you know, trying on different levels, you can go down a little bit or go up, you know, depending on how they're doing in their lessons. So that's, um, that's just a wonderful thing. So you have access as a teacher, you as a teacher, you go pick and you go into your login area and you can add your students in there and you can add, uh, assign them, you know, their tasks to do. So you go ahead, you assign the task and then on, on the, uh, you know, student lo login, they see the, the task that you assign for them. You can assign the task, you can put some timeline on when, you know, they need to finish the task and when they're done with it, you'll get a report of how they did. So this is basically what it you know looks like i i just want to give you an overview so i'm going to go ahead and show you the program so you can see exactly what i'm talking about it's hard to talk about an online program if you don't look at the online program so i'm going to go ahead and turn it around just show you very quick where everything is and what you see and what your child sees so you can get a better idea of what the math program what this math you know program is about. One thing, I do recommend this program. Um, I think for kids that are really, uh, you know, struggling in math and need extra practice in, you know, different areas, I think this will be ever good because of the, your ability to be able to go back and forth, you know, depending on their level. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn the camera so you can, I'm going to show the computer the CTC math. So when you sign in as a parent, this is what you are going to see right here. 
Okay, this is where you have your student. And when you click on here, you can add a, another, uh, another student. You can give them a username and a password. Okay, you can put what their passing grade is gonna be, how many attempts to be able to pass it. So that's where you do this right here. Right here, you can see the task that you know the students have been assigned to right here. And then this is where you add task. So you can go click the plus sign where it says latest, where it says latest task. You can add the dates that you want, you know, your, your student to have to complete that task, the title, the description, and then you go ahead here and add lessons. So as you can see, you have all courses here from kindergarten all the way to calculus. So I am working on, I'm going to put here fifth grade. Um, and my daughter, I haven't mentioned, she, uh, you know, she has a disability. So we're working on a five, fifth grade math. So this is what I always look at when I'm looking at math. It's about fifth grade level. So you are, you are going to click in any of this list. So, so the ones here are the ones that, that has a little you know, icon thing, is the one that she's working on, and these are the, uh, the other ones. So you click as many as uh, tasks that you want her to complete, and you do save task, okay? So this is right here where the student has, has you know, the task that they are working on, okay? So when you, your child signs in, this is what they see. Okay, and then this is the active ta uh, task that they have to do, and they have how many days they have to, uh, you know, have it done by. So you click here, and then you can see, and then they, they can keep working on the, you know, on the lesson. So for next lesson, we'll be here, would be time ta times table missing number. We'll do some more work now on times tables. This time we need to So they will look at the time. lesson. Examples, we're asked to fill in the missing number. Now, I'm going to ask you a question before I give you the answer. I'm going to pause to see whether you can find the answer before I give it to you. Okay, so this is just kind of okay. a review. Once they are done with that, with, with the video, you can go here to the questions, and then you'll start the questions, and then they will, you know, fill them out. Okay, it, it will show here the ma if they have done mastery, and then once this whole thing is uh, is filled in here, they are done with the activity. But if they show mastery of this pro uh, of the problems on the set, you you will you know the student will see it here. Okay, so this is where they can work on on their less on on their activity, and you can also the lesson summary. You can see it right here. Okay, so these are, you know, the problems that are in the lesson. Okay, you can see it as a PDF. And then you can see how many lessons are going to be on that, you know, specific topic that we picked. Okay. So this is what can, what your student will look like if you go back to the task. So you can see all the lessons, times table, mix, mi missing number, expanded notation, and once they're finished, you'll be able to see the complete sign here. And you should be able, once you get all the all the lessons, you as a parent, you'll receive a, a an email with everything that your student has done. Okay. So if you can see here, a hundred percent first attempt, and then you know all all the problems were at mastery. And then you're able to, you know, download it too. So this was just a quick overview. I could sit here and go through everything, but a quick overview of what uh, CTC math is. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure when you're done watching the video that check the description box for, my, for everyone's review and also link for CTC math. I will see you all in my next video.